Organizing your calls with Radius's Call Queue feature will help you to speed up your call list. We're going to cover how to create them, how to manage your call lists, and how you can automate leads and clients to populate in at certain times in their life cycle with automated workflows. Let's go to Settings. Phone Dialer and Call Queues. Edit. Click on the Call Queues tab. We've entered this hot lead call list to get you started, but feel free to edit. Click Edit. Enter a name like Call Number One Needed. Put it to Sort Order 1. The Sort Order is the way it will appear in your queue list. Queue Order 1 is always the default queue when you go into Call Queues. Let's add some more. Call Number 2 Needed, Sort Order 2. Call Number 3 Needed, Sort Order 3. You can create as many or as few as you like. I like to think of my call lists as how we get from a new lead to a quote to an active client and then how I'll check in on my active clients. Okay, let's see what we've created. Go to the call queues on the left sidebar. You can see that call number one needed is the first list we see displayed. That's because it's sorted order number one. Click the drop down to switch between call queues. You'll see they're in the order that you created with that sort order. Let's see how to add people into call queues. One way to do it is a bulk update. Go to Leads, filter by, let's say, New Lead. Select All, bulk update to the proper call queue. Submit. You can also go into the individual file, scroll down on the right, and you'll see the call queue cloud. Click on the name of the queue to add them. Let's choose Quote Follow-up. You can manually remove them from the call queue by clicking on that X, but let's choose it so we can see how it looks in the queue. Let's go back to call queues. We see those new leads in this list. If we switch to Quote Follow-up, that person is in there. Once you've called someone, You'll also see when you last called them here. To remove someone from a queue on this page, you can select the box next to their name and click Remove from Call Queues. You should also check out the video on automated workflows. That way you can tell the system when people should go into a queue automatically and when they should be removed from that queue. Make sure that you've set up your dialer before starting these calls. See our knowledge base or the email that we sent you upon activation of your account entitled Radius Dialer Setup.